What's up guys, it's the Turn Dorf for the Tech and today we're going to take a look at the Tamagotchi app for Android. So, the app was released yesterday, it's called Tamagotchi Life, um, it's made by Namco, and it's free. So let's go ahead and open it up, and yeah, it's kind of loud, let's lower that a bit. Alright, so you see here you have two modes. This is app mode, where you get to interact with your Tamagotchi via touch. You get to touch the uh, multiple little options and use them just by, you know, tapping on them. This is like the uh, the newer version of Tamagotchi for like, you know, people who never had the little egg thing before. If you want the little egg thing, then you press the viewfinder and you can actually toggle the mode. So here is the Tamagotchi actual egg mode. And you see everything is operated with the buttons. Works just like the regular Tamagotchi. It's very nice actually, you find myself enjoying this quite a lot. One thing you do notice, um, on this screen the, the Tamagotchi is black and white. Whereas on the app finder, on the viewfinder, um, he's actually uh, yellow. Um, when your Tamagotchi starts evolving or what whatnot, whoa, vibrated. Um, when your Tamagotchi starts um, upgrading or whatnot in the app finder mode, he changes color. It's random. You, there's no predetermined set to find out what color he turns into, but it changes color. So right now my Tamagotchi is sleeping because it's like nine in the morning. Uh, only time I can find to record. Um, look at the different options. So we press little Tamagotchi that just takes us back to our Tamagotchi. Uh, you press the other button, that's like the uh, settings mode thingy, you can choose what, you can see the Tamagotchis you have. You see, this is the one I started with, Baby Chi, and now I have Maruchi. Yay! And it's yellow. Let me go back. I uh, see these are all the different Tamagotchis that can be unlocked, as long as you don't know, keep you know, feeding your Tamagotchi, not letting it die. Um, you can choose different wallpapers to set up. Um, I currently like the uh, this one, but you can set up the different wallpapers you get basically when you get um, your um, your Tamagotchi raise points. I think that or stars. Not entirely sure how that works. Uh, shells. You can change the shell of your Tamagotchi thingy. So right now mine is blue because you know I kind of like blue, but um, I can use the yellow one. The yellow one came when the Tamagotchi grew up a bit and turned yellow. Um, so you have quite a few here to choose from. You get them with stars, I believe. And that's pretty much it for that one. Let's go back to Tamagotchi. And yep, still sleeping, so not much there. When he is in the viewfinder, you can you know, tap him in. He'll do things. You can take screenshots. Uh, save to gallery. Do -do. Although I pretty much just rather do this. <gasps> oh, wait, I fucked up. Wait for it to go away, and there you go. You know, screenshot in the normal way, so that we run Android devices. You don't need you know screenshot buttons, but you know that's there. And when you press home, you're back into the main setting where you can uh, reset your Tamagotchi and whatnot, and do all these other nice functions that apps should have. You touch the starting, you're back to your Tamagotchi. Alright guys, so if you have an Android phone and you want to relive the magic you had in the 90s, get yourself the Tamagotchi Life app. I do have to say this, he gets a little annoying when he starts calling you randomly during the day and bothering you to feed him and to clean him. It's, yeah, let's just say I was in the middle of something yesterday and yeah, no, Tamagotchi, shut the fuck up. But yeah, you guys can check that out, okay guys? So this is the Tinador for the Techer.com and until next time, we'll see you later.